Hey, 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 everybody! Apple D here with some with a tor tutorial, excuse me, on how to use Google SketchUp, Google SketchUp Pro of year or version eight or whatever you want to call it. All right, so we're on Google SketchUp. Okay. Now, let me first say, when I got Google SketchUp, this bar wasn't here. And so to make this appear, if you're new, come down to View, Toolbars, Large Tool Set. And as you can see, it's gone, and it's back, okay? So you new people out there, uh, if you don't know how to get this, now you know. You can go ahead and delete that guy. Click on it and then press delete on your keyboard. Now, <coughs> let's. You want to make a cool intro. I'm guessing, since you've clicked on this video. What you want to do is, you don't have to, but you can come down to this uh, Trimble 3D warehouse. And to me, it's easier uh, to use this to and then get your texts. And I'll show you why in a little bit later. So we're gonna come down. We're gonna write. You can you can look anything up. Uh, we'll do gun, for instance. You get a bunch of guns, right? And I'll do Thompson's submachine gun. Okay, here's your model. Now, what what you do once you get this? Download model. Load this directly into your SketchUp model. Press yes. Downloading progress. Bytes read, and here's your model. All right, now, now, now that you got your gun, move it over a little bit. Now that you have your gun in place, press the three D text. Type in whatever you want to say. So I'll do apple dumpling, of course. Presents. Place. Now, see how big these words are? Okay. If they were deep, if you had no picture here, you would lay on the floor. And it's kind of tricky to get them to face up like this. Okay. So that's why I had you get a picture first, so you can level it into the position you want. So you can go down. Okay, but I want them. I want the text smaller. How do you do that? Well, come down to this box with an arrow kind of a thing right here. Let me do something real fast. All right, sorry about that. Come down to and you'll get. Yellow bat or yellow outline with green squares on each side and in the middle. This allows you for 3D text and sizing text. Okay, now that we have our size right here, zoom in, grab that, and you got yourself some 3D text. Okay, now grab your movement bar or whatever and move it into place just like that and if you want you can move it down you can move it up and then you can rotate it or whatever but we'll have it right there Apple Dumplin' presents. Let's get our next part. Add text. Let's do Let's Play Planet Side 2. See how they're big? Just change the size. Give it a little bit of 3D effect. That's a little too much. Let's bring it down a little bit. Just like that. Perfect. 
and let's move it over just because I don't want you guys or the, the viewers to see this part when they're supposed to see this part. Okay, kind of get, it's kind of a distraction. So let's move that on over. You can put that right there. Just like that. And actually what we can do, double click that, or click that, and we can, oh, one moment. There we go. Just actually, let's move that right here. Actually, it's not the prettiest thing, but this is a tutorial, so it doesn't really matter. Matter, matter. Well, let's just give it. All right, now. You have your your title or whatever. Let's make this into an animation. Okay. What you're going to do is edit. Or no, excuse me. View animation settings. Okay. S where it says scene delay, make sure that's zero. That that's how long it takes to transition between each scene. And so what you want to do now is view animation as seen bam all right now nothing changed do you want to make do you want to stay in, stay in track and what how many scenes you have and what they are well to do that view animation or excuse me view scene tabs click that and there you go you can see you have one scene so if you come over here you click that scene, the scene tab, and it'll take you to this part. Now, there's two ways to make scenes, one faster than the other. The faster way is get into position, Apple Dumpling presents, right click on the scene tab, and add. So one, two. Now, a slower way. is going to view animation at scene and one two three okay now that that's done get your other part at scene at scene at scene at scene, at scene, at scene, at scene, at scene. Okay, there, now we're done. Now, you can go through each individual uh, tab, right? But to play it sim semi simultaneously, yeah, you go to view, animation, play. Okay, now I'll take you to the first scene. Just like that. Okay. And so when you're done with your back, you can add backgrounds and stuff like that. But for right now, um, I think we're done with this. So what you're going to do is file, save as. We're going to do Thompson Planet Side 2. Enter. Okay. All right, now what we're going to do is export animation. This is very important. 3D graphics picture, 3D model is a model and you can't do anything with it. But animation, 
you can animate you can use it as an animation okay so export animation exporting okay now we're done so we can close out of that maybe later go on to your movie make your I'm using Windows Movie Maker right now uh, but you can use any of your vi video software okay click here to add browse videos or whatever I have this to go to my mass storage S SketchUp intros and here are all my intros find your one find your current one Thompson Thompson plant side 2 open that up okay um i had music on one of my earlier videos that i just barely deleted previous to this and I left the music here but to add music go to add music and I have a whole bunch of music well not really but and actually if you want you can even add them up so there oh no you can't okay nice to know that but I want this one. No remove. Now, let's see. Okay. I'm going to have this fade in. So go to music tools. Fade in. Me no, I want fast actually. Then fade out. Medium. No, let's do it slow. Fade out. So, start time, yes. So now that we did the fade in and fade out, it's fading in and fading out. Watch. Just like that. Okay. Now, um, get your footage right. So we'll do add video, mass storage, rocket films. Here is a whole bunch of them. We'll do a very short clip. What is that? Hello. Nope, that's a long clip. We'll just do, um... That. Okay. I think it's... That's not gonna work. But anyways, you get the idea. Put a piece of, uh... Of... Video. Thank you video right here and uh, if you want you can also put one of these for the end like thanks for watching please like and subscribe or whatever um, but yeah I, I, I hope you guys uh, like this and I hope this helped you out a lot um, if you did if it did help you out a lot and it, you did like it why don't you leave a like and subscribe it helps me out a lot you guys and uh, I don't know see you guys later and uh Peace.